North, south, east, and west. A compass is normally used for direction. Selene Area Schools has adopted this idea to guide learners to the path of success. Jackson Jost tells us more. Selene Area Schools does a lot to prepare students for future endeavors. One of these is the Student Learner Profile, also known as the Compass. But what is the Learner Profile? We went to Mr. Graydon to find out more. The Learner Profile stemmed from a project we were looking at in terms of a thing called Profile of a Graduate. Thinking more deeply about what are the skills and necessary for students to be successful as they transition from Saline High School or Saline Area Schools into life and so we define those as the eight student attributes that appear on the compass and then some of the strategies around how do we go about making sure that the environments of our buildings and our classrooms help students grow in those areas. So the compass itself uh, is laid in, in really three layers. The, 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 the first layer is the big four C's and those are the largest points of the compass and it's creativity, communication, collaboration, and critical thinking. And really looking at that as, a, as those C's really are the, the foundational skills we want our students to, to really possess and to have. Values on the compass can be applied to entering any career in the workforce and are based on what the top Fortune 500 companies want to see in their workers. I think from a standpoint of what we want students to know about the Compass is really to, to really understand and have a level of awareness that the world they're moving into is fast paced, it's very different than the world in the past, and so their ability to adapt and have the skills that allow them to adapt are going to be critical. Many of the rankings put our, our student scores uh, among the highest in the country. And really, as a staff and as a community, we felt that's great and we're very proud of those achievements, but we want to push a little bit further and think about students who are entering to college, entering the workforce, and what are the skills they're going to need to be successful. Reporting for SHS Today, I'm Jackson Jost. Back to you in the studio. As you can see, the Compass helps, helps guide students to the skills needed to succeed in the workforce. If you have any more questions about the Compass, ask an administrator or go to selineschools.org.